you all, man. <laughs> yeah, hope to. Just. Obviously, you've got your, your Ronaldo's, or, or your big players, really. I mean, I always think that these tournaments is always a team that you know you, you expect might not do too well and always achieve something. So there'd be a few that catches our eyes, I think, and um, you know, I think it's the it's not individual players. I think it's the, the team that gets it together as a group that you know normally does well. Uh, well, there's obviously quite a few, but you know, I do think France have a really good team. Um, got a strong team, a young team, um, and obviously on, on home soil, which, which yeah, I'm sure the, the pressure will, will go up a little bit, but also it can really help them. So uh, in their team, Pogba uh, played against him for, with Sweden against France not too long ago, and he, was, he ran the show, to be honest, and he's a, he's a quality player, so I think he'll be a massive player if they're going to achieve success. Um, otherwise, it's the, it's the, the usual suspects, Ronaldo. Um, Rooney, I do think Rooney, uh, England need a Rooney in top form. Uh, he's been there, he's done it all, and he's their top goal scorer. And I think when you, when you go away to a tournament, like Wes was saying, that the pressure is just something else. And it builds, and uh, you're in a little bubble, and it kind of explodes. So I think you do need players that have been there before and experienced it to, to sort of help the, the guys that haven't been at the tournaments before. As Jay was saying, obviously the hype before a tournament when England qualify for one is always increased no matter no matter what where the tournament is, who's playing, what squad is picked, they always think they have an amazing chance. But as Jay was talking about the the younger players that have come into the scene, some of the players coming back from uh, injury, um, that I really do think they could cause a well for me it wouldn't be much of a shock because I, I obviously playing against the players you realise the quality that they do have, so I'm reckoning for England, I'll go semi-final. Serious? Semi-final. I don't know, like we said before, you, you, you never know in tournaments, I think everyone's got a chance. Um, would you say you've got a tough group? Ah, well, on, so on I paper, watching, on I'm, paper I remember watching tough. your game against Germany, an unbelievable performance and, <clears throat> and like I mentioned before it would, it would, it would be nice to, to see them do well and I think what's special about Ireland is the public of Ireland is you know the following the fans um, you know, the, the support that they've got and, and the spirit and it always seems like um, I think the big, thing, got the big thing for us is hope yeah. if we get out of the group and we take it from now because that's obviously what we want to improve on from 2012 and obviously getting out of the group, but if we can do that, that that's a step in the right direction and we, we see what happens. And play England, they won the tournament. Yeah. That was it, knocking England out in the semi-final. <laughs>